I want to move on real quick because you, you mentioned that um, you actually work uh, a remote job. And I think a lot of people uh, out there, you know, aspire to have a remote job too for all of the benefits that we spoke about earlier. Um, but their concern is that, oh, no one's going to hire a junior engineer as a remote engineer. And they always, they typically want someone sitting next to them or they rather they want someone to be in the office to learn that way and not be brand new as a remote software engineer. What are your thoughts on that? I guess that fear, that thought about trying to get a remote job as a more junior software engineer? I think that the industry as a whole is moving towards the remote path. I think that companies are realizing that we don't need to spend a lot of money on these lavish buildings with all these amenities that tech industry is known to have and allow our uh, developers and our employees to stay in the comforts of their home. I, I don't think that any junior developer needs to, to fear the possibility of not being able to work remote. There's plenty of opportunities out there for remote work. Now, what is important whenever it comes to re remote work is that you need to figure out how to properly communicate and you need to make sure that you're in a company that also cultivates the idea of proper communication because of the fact that as a junior developer, we're still learning. There's a lot that we need to learn and you need to be able to comfortably reach out to, you know, a, a senior engineer or your team lead or just a regular coworker that's also a junior that might have a bit more experience as you and expect to have a, a good answer or, you know, a good conversation with them. So I think that what a junior developer needs to start working on is how to properly communicate um, because it is harder to communicate remotely over being able to talk face to face. So that kind of leans itself back over to learning also how to ask good questions as well. So I don't think that there needs to be a fear uh, of being able to work remote. Most jobs, if you look on uh, sell, uh, on uh, LinkedIn or you know, OTA or these other job board posting boards, a lot of them are remote. But you also need to realize that a lot of people are going after these remote jobs. So there's there's that as well. If you enjoyed this clip, make sure you watch the entire video, which has a lot more content just like this. And if you want to make sure you don't miss any of our episodes where we talk to leaders in the tech industry, from software engineers to product managers to engineering managers, make sure you subscribe to the YouTube channel and also click the notification bell. 